remember. All I'm offering is the truth, nothing more. Hello guys, welcome to Mr. Legend Crypto. Guys, in this video, we'll be taking a look at an old coin, Mina. Mina is ranked 87 on coin market cap with a market cap of over $366 million. The last one week has seen Mina gone up by 4.8%. While deep in the crypto bear market, Mina on a yearly time frame is down 31.4%. We're seeing some signs of life in the old coin market. We're awaiting that old season of 2023. Right now, we are in Bitcoin season. In this video, we're we'll taking a look at the MENA US dollar price chart. MENA has dropped to new lows in this bear market. Are we getting ready for that big, big all season pump to the upside? Or are we going to continue our journey deep down gobbling town? We're also going to take a look at MENA's performance against Bitcoin. We're going to take a look at MENA's market cap. How high can the market cap go in the coming days and the coming weeks? We'll be talking about that and more in this video. But first, guys, an investment in knowledge pays the best interest. When it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. Do the necessary research and analysis before making any investment decision. Let's get down to business. The oil coin market has been deeply affected in this bear market. We've seen a lot of oil coins drop into new lows. Deep in Goblin Town, that's where the most money is made. Deep in Goblin Town, that's where smart investors are accumulating. And right now, Mina is down 31.4% on a yearly time frame. The market cap of over $366 million and a 24-hour trading volume of above $9 million. MENA has a circulating supply of 986 million tokens with a total supply sitting just above a billion tokens. MENA has a fully directed market cap of $403 million. Where can you get some MENA if you want to get some? You can get some on Binance, on Coinbase Exchange, on Qcoin, on Kraken, and anywhere you get your popular altcoins. MENA protocol is a minimal succulent blockchain built to curtail computational requirements in order to run dApps more efficiently. MENA has been described as the world's lightest blockchain since its size is designed to remain constant despite growth in usage. Let's take a look at the MENA US dollar price chart on a weekly time frame. MENA was launched way back in June of 2021. It had a dump to Goblin Town just like every other altcoin that is normally launched. Then we saw one little pump to the upside, a 700% rally in the ending phases of our bull market. MENA couldn't get to new all-time highs. A $1,000 invested in MENA would have returned over $5,000. Over $5,000. But guys, the bear market is always brutal to all coins. The bear market is where crazy things happen. The bear market is the direct opposite of what happens in the bull market. If you think things get exciting during the, bear, during the bull market, things can get really, really boring in the bear market. We have seen MENA dumping for more than two years consecutively. Yes, we have had some pumps along the way. We had this rally where we stayed 2023 on a very bright note. We saw MENA giving us about a 200% pump to the upside. What has happened after that? MENA has taken back those gains, dumping back to Goblin Town, dropping to a new low. But that's to be expected. If you're a long-term investor, you're not going to be afraid. If you're a long-term investor, you're waiting for that long, long, big pump to the upside. And right now, we're seeing some signs of life in the altcoin market. But guys, there's one final piece of the puzzle that we need to be correct, and that is all season. We're currently in Bitcoin season. The all coin season index tells us where capital is situated in the cryptocurrency market. And over the last 90 days, Bitcoin has been performing better than a lot of all coins. Over the last 90 days, Bitcoin is up 1.1%. We have a lot of all coins that are down bad in Goblin Town. If 75% of the top 50 coins perform better than Bitcoin over the last 90 days, it is all season but if bitcoin is performing better than them it is bitcoin season so if we see that all season happening i would expect to see mina joining the party i expect to see mina pumping to higher prices key levels to watch out for for mina when that pump happens we're going to face a lot of difficulties along the way it's not going to be a smooth ride to higher prices the 0.42 dollar level we saw mina forming a base around that region but over the last few weeks over the last few months we have seen mina slowly creep below the 0.4 dollar level so i'll not be shocked if we finally reclaim that region and maybe hold on to it and that key level i'll be watching out for is the one dollar region we saw mina rally towards that one dollar region earlier in the year but we couldn't sustain that price level buyers did not show and now we have a lot of sellers and mina is down to new lows but guys when we see all season these moves can happen very very quickly before a lot of people know that the move is happening we're already in the moon so you want to buy when we're low when we're down you want to buy when the market is fearful you want to buy when the market is boring 
So when the market starts getting exciting, when we start seeing green bubbles every day, all coins pumping 20 to 30 percent daily, you will be selling for some sweet, sweet profit because that's what we're here to do. We're here to make some money. But you want to buy low, you want to sell high, you don't want to be buying high and be selling low. And that key level to watch out for will be the three point one nine dollar level for Mina. We saw Mina rally into that region way back in two thousand and twenty two. If we see Mina rally into that $3.1 level from where we're currently trading, that will see Mina going up by around 800%. And guys, 800% pump will be something to write home about. If we see that long awaited all thing before the end of 2023, at 800% pump will be very, very glorious. And in hindsight, it will look as if it was obvious, as if we should have bought Mina. Guys, in hindsight, they say it's always 2020 in the cryptocurrency market. Hindsights make everything look easy. When you look at all these coins pumping to the moon after all season, you'd have wondered why didn't you accumulate when we're deep down in Goblin Town. If you take a look at Mina's performance against Bitcoin, we have seen it continuously losing value against Bitcoin. That's what happens when the market is very, very bearish. A lot of market participants run away from risky altcoins back into safety, which is Bitcoin and Ethereum, sometimes the US dollar. If we see all season happening, it means people are ready to gamble. It means market participants are ready to buy altcoins. We'll see Mina gaining value against Bitcoin probably 100, 200, even up to a 500% pump is possible before the end of the year. If you take a look at Mina's market cap, we have not dropped to new lows. We are still way off new lows. More Mina has come in circulation. That's why you're seeing the price down at new lows, while the market cap is still holding on strong. Or maybe more Mina has been born. But lucky for us, Mina's market cap sits at $365 million. We can easily see Mina's market cap holding that crucial support level. And if we can do that, and we see all season, I believe Minas market cap will be on its way to higher values. We have even dropped to as low as the $311 million level in this bear market. In 2023, the highest Minas market cap has gone is the $1 billion region. Can we reclaim that $1 billion region? Guys, it all depends on all season. If we see Mina giving us the pump we expect, a 100, 200, maybe 500% pump to the upside, Mina might even get to new all-time highs. Drop your thoughts in the comment section. Are you a bull or are you a bear? If you're a bear, you're expecting lower prices. You're expecting Mina to continue dumping for that multi gobbling town. If you're a bull, you're expecting higher prices. You're expecting that longer with it all season. So where do you see Mina heading to in the coming days and in the coming weeks? Drop your thoughts about that in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you're new here. You can follow us on social media platforms, on Facebook, on Telegram, and on Twitter, at Mr. Leden Crypto. Remember, guys, when it comes to investing, nothing will pay off more than educating yourself. And investment in knowledge pays the best interest. Invest for the long haul. Don't get too scared. Don't get too greedy. See you guys in my next video. Remember, all I'm offering is the truth, nothing more.